Osteoporosis is a problem that develops because you lose calcium and other minerals from the bones and it causes low bone strength and makes you more at risk for having fractures. The major ones that we worry about are the spine, um, the vertebrae in the spine, and the hip and the wrist. Uh, there are a number of things that can increase risk for osteoporosis, including uh, smoking, drinking lots of alcohol, lots of caffeine, um, having a family history of osteoporosis, uh, being white or Asian uh, slightly increases your risk, but uh, blacks and Hispanics also get osteoporosis. Um, if you have some condition that causes early menopause or early stopping the menstrual cycle for women, uh, that will increase your risk, such as uh, an eating disorder like bulimia or anorexia. Um, some uh, female athletes uh, will stop having menstrual cycles early and may be at more risk. Uh, for men, primarily it's low testosterone. That The best way is to have a, a test uh, where we measure your bone density. Uh, the most common test and the one that we do here is called a DEXA scan. Uh, it stands for Dual Energy X-ray Absorptiometry. Basically we use a machine that uses a very low dose of X-ray, uh, not even as much as having a chest X-ray, uh, and we measure bone density at the spine and the hips, and occasionally at the wrist. The treatment for osteoporosis, um, we need to make sure people are getting adequate amounts of calcium and vitamin D. That depends on your age, what those recommendations uh, really are. Um, and then there are medications that uh, help reduce the loss of bone um, and thereby allow the bone density to improve. And there are also some newer medicines that actually help the body build new bones. So we have treatments that work in quite a few different ways to help improve osteoporosis.